Oh, we intro in? Yep. Is this episode three? I don't know, cause we had we had one or two before, and but but this is episode started episode three, cause you had two and then you did yesterday. Now yeah. today is a fresh day. We haven't even started on the spoiler yet. <laughs> Good math. <laughs> Good back here. Got everything cut out for this giant wane we're doing. And so basically, these are gonna be the main support. They're gonna get glued and screwed uh, back here to the rear hatch. And then it's gonna provide the, the angle uh, for the wing there. Now, is this for downforce? No, this thing probably will not be seeing speeds over you know 35 miles an hour, especially with those tires on there. But uh, this is for aesthetics. So, and that's important to us. Be able to still open the hatch of the wing attached. Okay, what do we think? Two spots to attach that? I think the more the merrier. The more the merrier. Sweet action, dude. How were you thinking you were going to get these to stick? I haven't. I haven't really thought that far ahead. <laughs> Do we find a way to get the right bend in it? Or at least just the start of a bend and then start heating it up. You see what she's doing is she's using the fiber weld to cover up these little holes. You know I'm messing around with pesky bodywork with actual steel and stuff. Just use Fiber Weld from JB Weld Family Products. Wow. More reactions. Can you tell the people about your um, trial and error? Uh, there's uh, only trial, no error. Uh, no, this, uh, so I wanted to get the uh, ABS a little bit of a shape to it before we try to stick it up there on the on the mount. And uh, after some mostly air, uh, I came up with this idea. So we're gonna strap ratchet strap it into uh, into shape, and then we'll put some heat on it. And then hopefully it'll uh, retain its shape once we pull the pressure up. This preliminary wing looks promising. Hello, doctor. Uh, all right, so we've got the wing, has shape to it. You got it like weighted down the other side. And what I want to do is I think that the two-part epoxy is, is stronger, uh, like head better adhesion than the steel stick. Uh, steel stick's good for like bulk applications and like having that like a putty. Uh, and I want that here. I want that, I want it structurally you know, because again, we're using ABS plastic, which is not meant to build aero. Uh, we're gonna come through and we're gonna grease all this with this quick weld and uh, and then hopefully it'll set up in six minutes or less and then we'll uh, start steel sticking it. And then uh, Taylor had the idea to uh, wrap the whole thing in this, uh, in the fiber, the fiber weld stuff to make it look, maybe, look, maybe look, make the whole wing look like it's carbon fiber, which would be pretty cool. All right, here we go. Smoky hat has been through some shit. Yeah. Probably literally. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh. Mansplain to me how you would typically. Not mansplaining. I'm just saying this is how uh, uh, you would usually run a couple cables or uh, uh, some rods uh, triangulating this because right now it doesn't have any sort of like lateral bracing and so it's going to be wibbly wobbly that way. Mm, good old lateral bracing. <laughs> this DIY weight setup you got. What are all of the waves that you can give another driver? You got the uh, finger. Yep. You got the hey hey. Okay. You got the van away. Okay, that's nice. You got the number one. <laughs> the other finger. <laughs> you got the other number one. Could do a little shaka. Yeah, you could do the boom, the, what is that? Like that. Then he would wake me up by zapping my feet with the uh, <laughs> electric fly racket. Probably on, yes, I would come over at the appropriate time, the time that we agreed upon, and yes, you'd still be in bed. The audacity, not only to not be ready, ask for 15 more minutes to sleep. <laughs> These are the details. <laughs> yeah, where are them salt blasters at? Um, I think pests are right oh, here. Pest control. Right here. I wonder if they sell cattle prods, we'll get tape with them. <laughs> you want to do pranks? We'll do pranks. <laughs> Here's a bug zapper right here. Oh, wow. So we got this, but we still need the... Uh... Do they sell those here? Or is that like a specialty item? I feel like this would be the type of place... That said, I know the competition in town has them. <laughs> we have to go I won't there. drop any names, but... I won't drop any names, like... Ace hardware. <laughs> 36 inch bar, three feet. That's a hog. That's totally a gas powered Makita. One of my friends told me that these aren't like actually super duper protective though. They're more like once you hit them with the thing, they just like go psh. You need to find the blasters. I don't think they have them here. No, there's gotta be a section of like impulse buys. <laughs> That's where I wanna be. <laughs> Hey, you hey. find any blasters yet? What? No, it's <laughs> We found this. <laughs> good, 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 good. You think they'd be in the same place? Yeah. I feel like we're getting closer. Oh. I should probably be with my boss. Ooh, okay. Okay. Wait, that? Um, family? Yeah. Well, I'll look it up in the computer and totally walk down the aisle and produce what I could. <laughs> It's because Ace has a helpful, friendly face to you can count on. Awesome. The stippling, Yeah, it's real nice, huh? If the spring feels firmer, it makes me think that it probably shoots harder, too. More powerful. Yeah, I think it's definitely got more juice to it. Do some drive-bys on some flies. <laughs> Boom, Randy. Alright. Bye. And now it's time to say goodbye. Yeah, I'm gonna go get the flies. You guys go get the cars. Mm -hmm. We'll reconvene after our missions are complete. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bye. Bye. We went and got coffee. We went to the hardware store. Hung out with Uncle Cousin Andy. We'll just eyeball the first one. Okay. And, um, and then we'll take the measurements off it. We're going to recreate it on the other side. And then do you want to do this side first because the No, because I see where your camera is. We'll go over and do that. <laughs> wow, it's like so obvious that we're going to need some serious... Great support? Yeah. I think I want to move that. That way, just so it's not so front-weighted. But I don't want to pick up. But you're just worried about the support down there? Yeah, I mean, it's, it, right, well, it's canted back just like you mentioned, so I'd like it to be ultimately have a more aggressive forward than you look. Okay. So I think that's gotta be, and it's like, 
and it's wobbly, which means that we're gonna have to create a lot of the strength with the product, which is, I guess, the whole point. So by using JB World products, we're gonna turn this wobbly mess uh, into something that's structurally sound. Yeah, this totally corrected the curve. This looks yeah, it's good. It's good. Okay, so now we readjust these. This Wait, one kind of like that fine. one. Yeah, that one. This one was a little up. twerked. We added a PVC pipe the entire length, both on the outside and the inside, just to give the wing more structure. I like it. Uh, get it louder than two part epoxy and then uh, yeah. get it up to 100 miles an hour and see what happens. Okay, we're continuing to bolster up the wing on the back of the Escudo, and this time I'm gonna use some of this uh, clear weld, uh, quick setting epoxy. So it says it, it uh, dries in five minutes. We're gonna dump both these tubes in and then go apply it. What I do already like about these is the tubes. Um, they just pour too super greasy, you've got it mixed up. Okay, what I'm doing is basically just getting it down here and pouring it into the end of this channel so it acts like a trough and builds up down there and. Hopefully it brings this thing some serious rigidity. <laughs> I was like, look at how serious he looks at me. <laughs> you couldn't keep it that real for that long. Oh, you're doing it right now? Yeah, I'm still sticking. Okay, what are you doing? I can do it in one hand, no hands. <laughs> oh, wow. How long do you have until it gets hard? Um. Show that. <laughs> it gets hard pretty quick. See, I'm just gonna stick it in there. Push Whoa. it in. Move it down. And the grinder works on this? Mm -hmm. Okay. Ooh, wow, that actually looks really that nice. Looks just steel Let's take a look at wow. that. Wow. Dude, that is legit body work. In I actually got like nice freaking body lines. Door delete, that's cool. Meanwhile, Miss Steel Stick USA is back here <laughs> working her magic. Oh man, that's my favorite sponsor. Great. Up grinding that down, or is this final product? I think this might be final. Okay. Do you think it looks ugly? No, I think it looks great. Think yeah, it looks nice. <laughs> really good. Yeah. No, we will ever know. Well, except the whole internet. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. I'll be over here. <laughs> Taylor, you ready? Give you two minutes. What? They're gonna, they close at five. They're gonna f love me rolling it at like 4.45. That's like that quote I said earlier. All mushrooms are edible at least once. 